Aloha, we're in our devotion time, and I hope that you're enjoying uh, our series on what the cross means uh, to believers. Today we want to talk about that the cross means that Jesus took the wrath of God for us. In Romans 3.25, in whom God has set forth to be a propitiation through faith in his blood. And then in 1 John 4.10, he sent his son to be a propitiation for our sins. Now that word propitiation is a big word, and it means to appease God's wrath, to satisfy God's wrath. It means to remove the wrath of God from us by way of substitution. And the cross is where God poured out his wrath against our sin in the suffering of Christ. And so sin does bring the wrath of God. The Bible says in Colossians 3, 6, also in Ephesians 5, 16, it talks about how that the wrath of God abideth upon the children of disobedience. And the Bible says in Romans 1.18, For the wrath of God from heaven is revealed against all ungodliness. God uh, is furious with sin. It's ugliness to him. It's abhorrent to him. And the wrath of God is the punishment against sin. But Christ took the full fury of God's wrath on the cross for us. That's why on the cross he cried out in anguish, My God, my God. Why hast thou forsaken me? In the moment in which he became sin for us, he was forsaken by the Father as the wrath of God, the full weight and judgment of the sin of humanity was uh, poured out. And so he absorbed the wrath of God uh, for us. And so what a blessing to know that we don't have to uh, cower in fear, that we can know that God has given us his love and and his pardon, and to know that we don't have to fear the wrath of God. And if you want to think about the wrath of God, just think about hell. That is, that is a, the best illustration, I think, other than the cross, of how the wrath of God can be meted out. But our Lord took the wrath of God for us, and that's why the cross means so much uh, to us. I hope that you're thinking about uh, Sunday school. We'll be starting a new Sunday school series uh, this coming Sunday. Hope you'll be uh, joining us for Sunday school, and we're looking forward to a great day in the Lord. Aloha.